Welcome to another product showcase video. Uh, this video is going to be on the Gelid Wing 1-2 PL 120mm case fan. Alright, well at first we're going to have a look at the case itself. Beautiful looking package, nicely uh, visible to see the fan itself, how thick it is, the, what the blades and everything look like. Information about the product itself, silent 120mm PWM fan with LED. This is a, a UV blade on it, so uh, if you have an ultraviolet uh, light in your case, it will reflect off the blades itself. Uh, the back panel itself has some information about silent operation, uh, detachable impeller, uh, the LED light itself, PMW controls, uh, as well as the uh, Nanoflux bearing. Um, that's something that's really special about the the fans by Gillette is they have their own kind of design for the bearings on them. Um, generally, most of your cheaper fans will come with like a sleeved bearing in them. Um, the advantage to the Nanoflex is that they use like a magnetic flux in the uh, fan itself. That way it keeps the lubricant from uh, coming out of the fan like you'd see with your cheaper fans. Uh, with the sleeve bearings, they uh, tend to lose the fluid out of them, and then the uh, fan dries out and basically seizes up because it can't turn anymore. So these have a real long life to them, as well as being fairly quiet, um, very comparable to the uh, ball bearing ba fans that you may see that are really expensive. They have a long life to them also, but they tend to make a lot of noise also. So this is kind of a nice compromise of giving you something that's uh, long life and uh, fairly quiet. Let's look at the uh, airflow on it. The uh, airflow is 128.6 CMH. Uh, bearing is a Nanoflux bearing. Cable length 500 millimeters, so it gives you a nice long cable. Its uh, the connector is a 4-pin Molex. Current is 0 0.45 amperage. DC voltage 12. Dimensions of it are 120 by 120 by 25 millimeter. The fan speeds operate from 600 to 1800 RPMs. Noise level is 10 decibel to 26.8 decibel on high. Static pressure is 2.66. This has a uh, three-year warranty on it, and the uh, total weight of it is 120 grams. So let's uh, open up the package and see what you get with it. But one thing I think is very interesting about these fans, I'm not sure how well it'll pick it up in the camera, or if you can see that there's a kind of a uh, ridge at the end of the blade itself. It's actually kind of sticks out maybe an eighth of an inch or so at the end of the fan. This is what they call their winglet design. Um, the advantage to that is to move as much air as possible and doing it at a lower RPM so you can get a lower noise with while still getting the same uh, CFMs that you may get with a uh, louder fan. That's a really interesting design. I don't think I've seen anything quite like that before. So I definitely wanted to uh, point that out to you, something that's unique to uh, Gelid's fans. Okay, inside the package you get the fan itself, and also it comes with your uh, mounting hardware. It has uh, eight rubber mounts uh, for anti-vibration, and it also comes with uh, standard case screws if you uh, just want to mount it in with your standard cross-threaded screw. Have a little closer look at the fan itself. Beautiful uh, color. I love the uh, blue on it. I imagine that's going to look really nice uh, with the uh, ultraviolet light. And also the uh, exterior of the fan is a gloss black compared to your flat blacks that most of your cases are. Uh, it gives it a really nice contrast to it and it helps the uh, 
fan blades to actually kind of shine on the side of the uh, enclosure. I'm going to flip this around to the back side here. Have a look at it. It has their decal as well as information about the product itself, what the voltage is, and also your uh, part number for it, which is nice if you uh, decide in the future you want to order a second one and you don't have the box or the receipt for it. You can uh, certainly uh, look at the back of the fan and it'll tell you who made it and uh, what the part number is on it. It has uh, wonderful specs on it. The nice uh, smooth feel and actually uh, relatively light. I don't think it's any heavier than uh, any of the uh, cheaper 120 millimeter fans I've seen. So the uh, Nanoflex bearing doesn't seem to add any weight to it. And I like the fact that you can kind of see through to the motor itself. That's a really nice feature. So we're going to open up the uh, cable here. Just to show you how long this is. I'm not sure the camera will even... <laughs> won't even pick it up but uh, it's a uh, nice long cable so you should be able to make it to your uh, fan controller motherboard wherever it is that uh, you plan on plugging it in at it does have the four pin connector so you'll be able to uh, monitor it and uh, control it with software through your BIOS or through your uh, uh, Windows applications whether you're using speed fan or whatever else you might be using to monitor your fan speeds so it's a, a very nice product. Uh, it looks good. The specs on it are very good. Uh, definitely something I would uh, look into if you're uh, looking to buy a new uh, case fan. It's uh, something that uh, probably not a lot of people realize that uh, Gelid sells case fans. So it's something you want to check out on their website. They have all kinds of different ones ranging in different uh, CFMs, different sizes, different colors. Uh, definitely go check them out. I'll put links in the uh, description for the video uh, where you can uh, check out this fan itself as well as all their products. So we want to thank uh, Gelid for sending us this fan. Again, this is their Wing 12PL 120mm fan. And thank you for watching.